Hey guys, my name is Simpsy. How are you all doing? Welcome to episode 4 of my Rust Solo Survival spawning in now and we haven't been raided. This is roughly what? Day 3? Day 3 and a half? My god! What an awesome tree just outside my base. I really like this small forest that's uh, come about. Okay, looks like another raid tower has been put up up the back. That's like the third one. The vault room hasn't been broken into. Still got my Bolty and Thompson. Let's go up and have a look at the cave base and see if that's been improved as well. Alright, it looks like it's had some improvements. So guys, if you still are enjoying this Rust Solo Survival series, I'd really appreciate it if you could leave a like and a comment. And also subscribe if you're new around here. So my god... A lot of upgrades. Looks like they've put like a TC outside. This is just menacing, is the word that comes to mind. The furnace base must be, yeah, pretty strong as well. So the main plan of today's episode is to go out on a couple more runs, use those new crossbows I have, and we need some rifle ammo for my bolties. Just noting away the fucking story of my life. The base isn't going to upgrade itself, you know. Alright, just out on a run near the power plant. Alright, let's see if the tower has anything to offer. Come on, Springfield and a stone hatchet. God damn it. A salvage pickaxe. How about the other tower? Oh, yes! Another bolty. I'll quickly just check this other tower and we'll head back. Man, I just fucking hate running back here. But now we have two bolties. The only problem is, because we're only level 13, we're probably not going to get to a high enough level to actually craft AKs and, and bolties and the assault rifles. And we just have to be very conservative of uh, my ammo. But if we can get this bad boy back... It will help the uh, duration, because, uh, well, you know, the duration, sort of like the wear and tear of the body. I can't think of the word off the top of my head. Nearly home, just making it through the forest. I really love that tree out the front. I'm not going to cut it down. And we're in. Alright, cool. We have two Bolties, one Thompson, and seven ammo and a dream. And then the four in each bolty. I actually hear someone outside. Quickly gear up with my leather clothing and Tom Cruise hat. <laughs> we don't even have like proper armor. Oh god. Lucky I got in with the bolty beforehand. I didn't want to run into this guy. He's probably from the cave. He's probably part of the clan. What tree is he behind? As soon as the tree goes, I'll know where he is. I don't want him to mine my... Not mine. Uh, harvest my cover. Oh, piss off! This guy's baiting me real hard. How did that not hit? <laughs> I'm so bad. He just keeps on strafing. Oh, that missed him by a bee's dick. Kind of ironic how I said I needed to be ammo conservative. Oh, shit. It's because I've got no armor. I just get absolutely wrecked like that. Astro. Ah, oh, you bugger. Alright, obviously, can quickly get my stuff back. But, uh, yeah, he was just really just baiting me. <laughs> Hard, big time. Oh, well. Live and learn. Sometimes you sh your shot's just off. You don't have the shot of the day. I'm constantly doing runs, but I just can't seem to see anyone. There's meant to be, like, 80 or 100 people or so on. Where the hell is everyone? 
Another gun crate here. Quickly check the tower. Ah, another fucking torch. This is, must be just a troll. And a Thompson. Not too shabby. And we have a bone club as well and a sword. Let's quickly go check the towers real quick. Run this back. So now we have a total of two Thompsons, two Baldies. Maybe we can go on some runs with the uh, the Thompson now. Gear up a little bit more heavily. Level 13. We're back at the vault room. Uh, I do want to add another airlock downstairs as well. I do want to repair this Thompson when I can, but a nice little hole from that run. Simsy Thompson. <laughs> Just look like a name there. Mining nodes is the fucking bane of my existence. <laughs> There's just so many here, though. They keep on spawning on this hill, which is just absolutely fantastic. I just need to get them before the clan does. It's time for a bit of a hunt, guys. Nice little piggy here. Oh. <laughs> I just glitched then. I don't think I shot it then. He just came straight towards me. Hit him twice with a stone hatchet. Are you kidding me? Oh, we should be able to get him now, though. Come on. Uh, there we go. That should get him. Ah, oh, bug here. He's absolutely hightailed it, but what's he doing? Nah, got him. Hawk's back on the menu, boys. I can see a guy in the distance just here. The power plant's just in front of him. I wonder if I can get up on him. Sneak up on him. He see me. Where you going, man? <laughs> Hopefully his base isn't too nearby. I think he was just picking up the rocks. And he's absolutely legged that. Armored door as well. I wonder if he'll come out. I'll just try and sit out the door and see if he pops out. He might have had some stuff. Let's see if I can get some cover behind this building. Actually, guys, I've got a really smart idea. Now, the bottom of this base here, the flooring of it, ha the flooring of it has been taken out. I don't think he's going to look here if he comes out the door. We'll sit here, lie in wait, crouch, and the moment he opens the door, we'll lose a shot. Come on. Come to Papa. All right, we sat there for a good long while. The guy who absolutely legged it just back into his base... Hear someone? Oh shit, he's geared. He's got a coffee and bone armor. I don't think he's seen me. I hit him. I think <laughs> he's just bamboozled as to where that arrow shot came from. Absolutely scared the shit out of him. He's hightailed it. I just want to craft some more arrows real quick. Level 14. There's a lot more players here now. Right, the uh, the power plant, Springfield, whatever you want to call it. Seems a lot more active. Let's quickly go get this horse here. Also, killing animals is a good way to level up. Bears especially, holy shit. This must be roughly where I got that... Um, all that loot off that dead guy in the first episode. Alright, quickly trek the gun crates. And another Thompson. <laughs> We're doing so well. What's going on the other side? Oh, 
Okay, quickly ferry my uh, Thompson back to the vault. Awesome stuff. Now we have three. I thought it was time to go check out the warehouse again. It's been favourable to me in the past. And another Thompson. <laughs> Obviously the Thompson's not the best sort of gun in the game, but it's better than nothing. Pistol ammo. Now I do believe we have four or so. There's a wolf down there. Is this a fucking joke? Why is it not moving? <laughs> so we have a glitched wolf here. Oh, that's hilarious. I've loosed about fucking seven into his skull. Maybe just driving a salvage pickaxe into his spine will work. Or his head. <laughs> this could be my pet, I guess. Why is it just chilling here? That'd be quite cool if you could tame animals. They do plan to put horse riding in the game at some point. Alright, the Thompson's back. Here is my loot room. So we've got a nice little hole going on. So four Thompsons. Two Balties. I'm back at the power plant now. There's a guy way off in the distance there. Just coming from the uh, warehouse beforehand. Gonna get Thompson. See if I can cut him off. He's just absolutely high-tailing it here. Yeah, I think, yeah, he's going to go left, I imagine. Yeah, there he is. Hit him. And he's down. Green t-shirt, running with the salvage hammer. Oh, Ramsey Snow as well. He's got a key. I wonder if he's got a house nearby. How funny was that other guy called Ramsey Snow? Probably deserved it, actually. BBC, Copless. Let's harvest this, get some hemp and animal f fat, I guess. Just sleeping on the train wreck here. At least we're a little bit geared. Oh, I've got the Thompson now. Going out on a run. I see a guy. He's charging straight for me. Looks like he's got a crossbow. Now what I want to try and do here, is if I can bait him across that bridge, get him in close proximity, I probably can take him out with a Thompson. Try and draw him towards me over the bridge. Come on. I am bleeding, I need to bandage up real quick. Come on, chase me. If I think... If he thinks I've only got a bow, hit him. Let's grab the Thompson, just charge him, let's go. Where is he? He's hiding in the bushes. Oh, come on. Fair play. Fair play, dude. Right, I'm going to try run over there and try and get my stuff back. I'll go with two crossbows. I see how we go. To be fair, I got a couple of pistol bullets off. That guy just outplayed me. Crossbows are so good in this. Oh, there's a wolf there. Okay, I've got two crossbows. Awesome stuff. The double tap. If the first doesn't work, double tap. One of the rules of zombie land or whatever. Now I'm fucking bleeding again. But this hunt has been successful. Got a couple of animals. Killed a couple of other people as well. Got and killed. Lost to Thompson. Not too bad. At least I tried though. Alright, let's harvest this puppy up. And then we'll be he uh, back on our way uh, towards the power plant, I think. Like I said before, it's gotten a lot more active than it was before. There was like, everyone was just like hiding in their bases or something, I don't know. There's a guy over there. Hit him. He's got a crossbow, but he's naked. Right, he's hiding over there. I might try and loose a grenade over the top. Haven't used a grenade yet, but... Oh, he's just going to sit there. I'm out of crossbow. Yeah, let's just go. Go for it. I don't know how high it goes up. Oh, no. We've just gone with, like it's, like... it's like a fucking underarm. Man, that's going to make a noise. Oh, I've been hit. Oh, let's try and double back over here. Looks like he's got a friend. Right, there was one of them, but I think there might be now two or three. 
Yeah, there's one guy coming. Hit him. <laughs> Gotta love that crunch with the headshot. So one down. There's one with a bow, but there might be a group of them. I'll try and grab his stuff, but... No, he's, he's got a friend there. Hit him. Hit him again. Oh, Jesus. I hit his other sort of half-naked guy. Right, this is fight or flight. I'm not going to win that. I took down one of them. Pretty proud about that. But then the geared guy just char started charging me. Fucking three verse one. Took down one. Couldn't get loot him, though. Doesn't look like they're giving chase now. Ah, oh, shame. Alright, back over to the... Warehouse now. Level 15. Just a wolf there, nothing really to see. The power plant has been pretty active, but let's go check out the airfield. Not as lucky as other times I've been here. Alright, what have we got here? A torch as well, what a fucking troll. Got a targeting computer from before. We have two crossbows. Pretty geared as well. Alright, anything up here? Uh, gun crate, cool. And we get... Uh, salvage hammer. Oh, you bastard. Only got a roadside killed and some wooden armor and a bucket helmet. Not the most best armor, but uh, better than nothing at level 15. Hunting animals and players in today's episode mostly. Not too bad, not too bad. Harvest this puppy up, then we're probably going to have to head back home, I reckon. Bagging and tagging. A lot more tagging than bagging, especially on the human part. We've taken down a couple of players here and there. Did lose a Thompson in the process. 150 cloth. Things have seemed to uh, quiet it down a little bit. I'll push up over here and see if I can see what's going on. I want to try and kill as many animals as possible to try and get my levels up a little bit more. Sort of a little bit of sick of resource, um, well, node getting. Going out geared is pretty fun though. Hunting animals. Constantly want to look behind me. Surely you guys should know where we are now. Back at the power plant and another stone hatchet. Another fucking torch. Now, people will have deliberately put them there, I reckon. Alright, let's move over to the other Springfield Tower. At least they've spawned back here again. Oh, fuck, yeah. Someone's definitely put those in. Can't seem to see anyone. After that sort of group I attacked before, sort of hightailed it, they must have had a base nearby and a bucket. Another torch. It's just being fucking cleared out. CCTV camera, not too bad. I do obviously want to take out those torches that they've been put in. I want stuff to respawn again soon. But like I said, it's sort of quietened down a bit. I'm surprised, it's a pretty high pop server. I am playing on Rostralasia low pop. I think the high pop's just too fucking crazy. <laughs> there's, there's enough clans, fucking eight verse person clans in this. Man, we're living up crazy. I keep going back and forth to uh, the airfield, the warehouse, and the he and the helicopters here. That's why I've got no clothes on, by the way. <laughs> Another Thompson. Okay, guys, back at the base now. Quickly bagging my fourth Thompson. 
I've been going to like the power plant, the airfield, the warehouse constantly. I've been seeing a couple of players here and there, but I just haven't been encountering encountering anyone on the on the road. I want to repair this other uh, Thompson though, however. That encounter against those those three guys in the groups. I did well. I hit all of them. Took out the guy with the headshot who was naked. Hit these other bloke, uh, bloke. But, um, yeah, that fucking geared guy was just running at me. I think he might have had, like, a, a semi-auto. But here's the Thompson, of course. Looks very nice. Well, the best is quickly get rid of the, some of that charcoal. But, yeah, we haven't got an overly huge hole. Just some cool weapons to have fun with. Alright, it's time to go back out on a run. Now that we have another Thompson to spare, maybe we can be a little bit more... Yeah, be a little bit more lucky, right. <laughs> Sending's I got taken out by those other guys with the crossbows. I don't know. Is a Thompson better? I guess a Thompson's better close quarters. The crossbows are, are really great for long range. i quickly carve this up. Level 16, slowly but surely making progress. Crush that. Let's see if anyone's at the power plant now. Go back on another run. I want to try and get a bolt if we can. It's always a good sign when this uh, crate's here at the airfield, a medical syringe. Uh, pa uh, power plant. Not airfield. Means the uh, stuff usually is spawned. I'll quickly check these crates here. But on that note, guys, it is becoming night time, and it is time to end the video here. We've roughly survived around about four days in the solo survival. It's sort of hard to check. But guys, thank you very much for watching. Well, it's not sort of hard to check. It's sort of hard to gauge how many hours exactly it's been. So it's roughly been about four days we've survived, haven't been raided. I sort of put that to my location. But I'm surprised the clan hasn't pushed for me, but hopefully touch wood. And, uh, yeah, hopefully we can survive a little bit longer. But thank you very much for watching. Like and subscribe if you haven't already. Check out my social media links, Facebook, Twitter, and Instagram, all in the description below. Make sure to take care of yourselves. Have a fantastic rest of your day. And stay tuned for more content on SimC Plays. Hope you have been enjoying the solo survival as much as I have. My name has been SimC. Goodbye. Here we go. That's a headshot. He's down. Fucking blew a bullet straight through the back of his skull.